hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is jimaima this is the part three of the series advice for 100 level medics if you've not seen the part one and two please go and see it i'll put the link up for you with that said let's continue another thing i'm going to tell you is if you're not sure of something ask questions but don't go and ask questions from people that we, you know you will scam you ask questions from people who are legit and who are the legit people your fellow cosmates that have gone through that stage you're at at the moment that is a good way you can get genuine information your school your i mean your faculty officer or your whoever it is that is your faculty officer or your faculty secretary you know those people in that your faculty office faculty of clinical sciences or faculty of basic medical sciences get information from them another person that you can get information from is your senior ask your seniors for whatever it is that you're not sure of you see these three people anybody outside these three people don't bother i'm not saying that they may not give you genuine information my point is you have a higher chance of being scammed if you ask questions from anyone outside these three sets of people another tip i'm going to tell you is join useful facebook groups and join useful whatsapp groups don't get yourself involved in any useless whatsapp group or any useless facebook group that will give you fake information your depart your department should have a group chat join your departmental group chat try if you resumed late try to look for whoever your course rep is ask questions and you'll definitely get to your course rep to join your departmental or your class group chat it's very important or if your school actually have an msc president try to look for when i say ms i'm talking about medical school association that's your medical school student association so look for whoever it is that is your president or treasurer or whoever it is that is a leader and that's your in your msa to link you up with whoever your course rep is it will help you a lot another thing is your friends choose your friends wisely don't be friends with just anybody that will lead you astray once you discover your friend is not pushing you to be a better medical student please it's not by force to have friends in hundred level in my hundred level i did not have one friend like this and i still succeeded so please you don't for 100 level you can succeed without having a friend use that 100 level to know your costmates know who the character of different people use the 100 level to know who will help you and who will drag you down it is from 200 level up that you can now know okay this is this person is my best friend person this 100 level is not the best time to have best friend though choose your friends wisely because your friends can lead you astray another thing i'm going to tell you is don't allow anybody to intimidate you at all you have gotten the admission congratulations you are not don't allow yourself have breed that mentality that you're in competition with anybody please the fact that social person is always asking intelligent questions in the class does not mean that person will pass more than you and even though the person pass more than you as far as you pass and you pass well that is what is important if you're in competition with anybody at all let it be with your old self be in competition with your old score don't go and be comparing your scores with anybody it's not necessary at all especially in this hundred level another thing is you must not read in the library i struggled so much trying to study in the library in hundred level and i discovered it didn't work for me and i had to look for somewhere else that i could study so my point is don't do what every other person is doing it if it is not working for you don't do what every other person is doing if it is not working for you you must not study in the library please do what works for you use your study do whatever study schedule that works for you don't follow other people to do their own it's 100 level is the best time for you to experiment and know what works for you by the time you get to 200 level trust me you would not have that kind of time to do experiments to know this one was working for me or this one is not working for me in your 100 level is the time to do as much as experiment as possible so that by the time you move to 200 level you already know the study plan that is working for you do not judge anybody please don't say oh, because this person is always telling you about jesus christ and how you should give your life to christ it means the person is a christian don't do that don't say oh, because this person is always reading it means that person is my good friend don't do that don't just judge anybody give that person the whole of you will be with these people for six years by god's grace so i mean use your hundred level to study people don't just judge anybody at all another tip is join your cosmates to do whatever they are doing when they are doing it don't when you see everybody submitting files at also time rush and submit with them don't go and delay and say oh i'll do it don't worry i'll do it later on i beg you in the name of god don't be like me that had to do last minute anything join other people to submit their files when they are submitting 
join every other people to do their registration when they are doing registration join every, everybody to submit assignment when they are submitting don't wait for a special time to do your own to prevent stories that touch your heart i'm not saying that you may not eventually be lucky you may be lucky but please be on the safe side and submit it when every other person is submitting i know why i'm saying this there's a way that you study for obj and there's a way you study for theory so if you know the nature of the exams they usually set for 100 level students in your school you will now be able to know how to study for it and sometimes these past questions are usually repeated so it's better to be on the safe side look for these past questions and study with it know how these things are said but at the same time keep an open mind things could change i can remember in my senior set they asked them theory questions in some courses but in my set it was obj cbt for that matter that we were asked so don't just be, keep a stringent uh, method of study be flexible because things could change at any time but then how do you get these past questions is from your seniors it is from your course mates that's why i said earlier on make your seniors your friends another tip i'm going to tell you guys is start from your 100 level to learn how to study smart start from your 100 level to learn how to work hard i usually see some or hear 100 level students looking for where to sort who's which lecturer to pay money to are you okay you are to be a medical student to handle the lives of people and from 100 level you're already looking for people to sort you're already looking for money to look looking for how to lie to your parents to collect money to pay to pass a particular course if you cannot pass your physics chemistry and biology what makes you think you pass physiology or the mighty anatomy or biochemistry if you can't pass normal physics chemistry biology that they have been teaching you from ss1 to ss3 that you have written jam you've written post to me please 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 no youtube subscriber of mine should keep money or habit in mind that is going to go and sort or look for money to pay any lecturer to pass don't do that learn hard work now now that you're in 100 level this is the best time for you to learn how to work hard this is the best time for you to learn how to work smart if you do not know how to work smart i have videos on my youtube channel on how to study for distinctions there are other youtubers on youtube where you can learn start learning now know the study plan that works for you know the study time that works for you it is your 100 level you should get this information if you start now to start looking for who to sort trust me you will really crash throughout your six years in medical school all right guys as usual i'm so sorry i just couldn't squeeze this video again to end here remember i'm talking about 30 plus over five to six tips for 100 level medics so by tomorrow i promise you the last part of this video will be out i remain your girl jemima remember to drop your questions in the chat box i definitely will attend to them see you tomorrow bye